cancer leaves scars, many invisible to the human eye, but lingering and painful inside of its survivors' hearts and minds. I know this because I was one of the 1.7 million people in the U.S. diagnosed with cancer last year. Two separate cancers, actually, breast and kidney cancer. My name is Petrina Ham, and I'm a survivor on a mission. Like far too many breast cancer survivors, it all started for me with a simple mammogram, followed up by two biopsies, a long visit to an oncologist who put me on a treatment plan involving placement of a port in my chest for six months of chemotherapy, a bilateral mastectomy with reconstruction, removal of my right kidney, six weeks of painful radiation, removal of my ovaries, capped off with what will likely be 10 full years of hormone therapy in the form of a pricey prescription. I lost my hair, my eyebrows, even some skin throughout my treatment. And yes, of course, also my breasts. Breasts that I nurtured two children through, breasts that my husband was rather fond of. Mastectomy, whether or not you opt for reconstruction, always leaves you with scars, and they are a brutal reminder of everything you've been through. Survivors can draw in their eyebrows and wear a wig throughout treatment to look and feel more normal. Their hair and their eyebrows will eventually grow back, but every time they look at their bare chest, they'll either see a concave space where their breasts used to be or strange nippleless reconstructed breasts. Getting a tattoo to either have 3D nipples on your reconstructed chest or a larger, more intricate design to cover your surgery scars can be a tremendously uplifting way for a survivor to reclaim control over their bodies after their treatment is done, to turn their scars into beautiful art, to heal, to get even beyond normal. Some insurance plans will cover the cost of having 3D nipples tattooed on reconstructed breasts, but many don't and none will even consider covering the cost of a chest tattoo to cover the scars. Getting a professional tattoo done can cost anywhere between $200 and over $1,000, depending on where you live and the skill level of the artist. Cancer treatment, even when you are insured, is terrifyingly expensive. For many survivors, it's just not a luxury that they can afford. They may not even know where to go to find a tattoo artist with experience in doing 3D nipples or working on scarred or radiated skin. And that's where you and I can come in. I'm working on starting an official nonprofit organization that will not only find and identify skilled tattoo artists to work with cancer survivors, but also issue full grants to pay for these tattoos for survivors who otherwise wouldn't be able to afford them. But starting a 501c3 nonprofit organization costs money, and that's where I need your help. There are various filing fees, accounting software, working with a tax consultant, insurance premiums, and a number of other expenses involved in launching this type of project. With your help, we can create this nonprofit org, begin taking tax-deductible donations, scout out for skilled tattoo artists willing to work with our organization, building a website to promote the organization, and working with cancer centers to get the word out to patients. We'll first kick off in my home state of North Carolina, and as this nonprofit grows, we'll expand to other states in the U.S. and ideally even start assisting survivors of other forms of cancer who are living with scars from treatment. Want to join in? There are three different ways you can help. Number one, you can become one of our founding sponsors by contributing to the launch fund at startsomegood.com slash art from scars. There are some pretty cool rewards there for donors, so be sure to check it out and give. Number two, join our email update list by sending me an email over at Petrina at PetrinaHam.com. Let me know you want to get involved and possibly volunteer in different events in your area. And number three is a big one. That is spreading the word and telling all of your friends. Be sure to share the link on any form of social media you use. I hope you'll join in on the launch and help cancer survivors turn their scars into to art. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the founding sponsors list.